what are the right words to relieve my chronic anxiety? Now, this is written by someone who has chronic anxiety, and they've been nosing around the internet, apparently, um, and have learned, I, I say learned because this is, isn't really the way I teach it, that there are certain scripts or magic words, right words, if you will, that you can add to the various tapping processes, um, you know, for EFT tapping. So if you get the right words, or at least so goes the actually erroneous belief, uh, and put that together with tapping, if you're at that level of your experience with EFT, tapping experience, um, then some kind of magic is going to happen. So but, but, but the belief is, all I have to do is tap and put the right words with it, and anything that I have as an ailment is going to vanish. Well, uh, that's not really so. Now, that does happen, by the way, on infrequent occasions. And of course, that gets reported, and, and everybody likes to see the very quick fix and, and so on. Okay? But if we're realistic about it, that's, it doesn't really work that way. What we want to get down is to what the real causes are. And, and the right words doesn't get to the right real causes. The real cause for chronic anxiety, or for that matter, anything else that we're working with, uh, really comes from within you. And it need, the process needs to be customized to you. Um, and so I can't take some magic words out here someplace and say, oh, these customized to you. No, you've got specific events in your life that are different than the specific events of anybody else in this world. <laughs> no two people have exactly the same uh, details in specific events in their life that give rise to the various ailments that we have. So we need to customize it. We need to, we need to throw away the right words thing if we're going to do this efficiently. And we need to start asking questions like, well, when did that first start? And... Um, what was going on emotionally at about that time? And if that doesn't work, we need to go into something like, uh, well, let's just start taking a look at, at many of your specific events. It has some grief involved with it, guilt, anger, fear, resentment, and so on. Ah, let's reduce those down to specific events. These are the building blocks of all of our emotional issues, by the way. Uh, and let's start collapsing them. That's what EFT does so beautifully and Unseen Therapist does so much more efficiently than mechanical tapping. Okay? So, let's get back to the right words things. Are there right words? Well, uh, maybe for some people and some things you can get some good results, yes. But if you're going to do it well, if you're going to do it well, you need better training.